stanzas of Kagranak. This must be what those are for. They're spheres, I think. They're spheres, or were they cubes? I think they were spheres. I've got them. I think I've got them all back in the museum at the chest near the bed. Oh. Do you know what this means, right? We're going to have to go all the way back to Solitude, pick up the stanzas, and then come all the way back here one more time. Well, if we're lucky, one more time. Crystal, first stanza of Kagnarak. Second and third. I'm assuming those are the um the items I need. I mean that's a fair assumption, isn't it? Yeah. I didn't carefully uh, inspect the receptacle. I should have, shouldn't I? What do you bet? It's three completely different stanzas and I've jumped to a conclusion and we're going to make a long trek back there tomorrow and find we wasted our time. We'll deal with that tomorrow. Right now, I need an awful lot of sleep and I also need, excuse me, I need to... There is no need to push. I, there is. I need to restock on healing potions. Actually, I have three excellent reasons why we're not teleporting back there. Reason number one, self-preservation. You may be comfortable with being teleported, but I'm still a little unsure of it, especially when said teleportation was created by the Dwemer. You know, those psychopaths that disappeared mysteriously. I'm not saying I can't see the benefit of it, and indeed, I can imagine using it in an emergency. But this is not quite an emergency yet. Reason number two, I'm not sure it would save us that much time. We would teleport to the tower, then have to work our way back through the ruin to the excavation site. So, overall, it's... You know, it's going to save us a little bit of travelling. And, of course, it would save us the carriage journey. And save us the... Oh, it would save us being attacked by cave bears. So that's reason... Oh, yeah, and getting lost. Okay. Reason number three. The staff was heavy, and I put it on display in the museum, okay? And without it, we can't teleport. So, yeah, you can get off the horse now. You can get off the horse, or you can just ride the horse a bit. Is this your way of protesting not teleporting there? It's not going to work. Okay, good counter-argument. All right, fair enough. If we have to make this journey again, we can try the teleportation. Happy? Hmm? Although then you'll get to miss out on all this excellent rain you love so much. Hello? Glad to see you've managed to make it out of the chair. It's progress. Yes, it is. Is the rain stopping? Yes, it is. Okay, where is the... That right up there is the area just off the, um, off from the machine, near to the bedroom. Oh. Really? It looks a little sheer, doesn't it? I mean, there's no way we could have artisans create a staircase up there. Shame, really. 
be nice if there was some elevator shaft or something down here. You really would like it if we moved here, wouldn't you? You could just sort of come out every day and enjoy the rain. Fair enough. I'm not, I'm not going to judge you for that. I'm not going to judge you for that. I'm going to think you're weird, which may sound like I'm judging, but I don't actually object to you being... What is it about this particular bit of... Is there something I should know? Is there a chance of landslides or something? All right, I think the guys are still cataloging because all of the stuff is still here. I'm assuming they would pack it up before they went. Yeah. Do you think maybe I should uh, buff up before we go in there? I'm thinking I should buff up. I really am. I mean, we don't know what's going to happen when I put these stanzas in the uh, receptacles. I hadn't really thought about that. I was just so happy at figuring out what it was we had to do to open it that it never occurred to me to question whether or not we should, in fact, open it. And, you know, on reflection, that does seem like something I should have considered and is probably a bad sign. Am I getting reckless? I mean, more reckless than... than usual. Overly reckless. Reckless beyond the bounds of reason. I'm trying to find a way of describing this that won't have you just nodding automatically as if we've always been this. I'm going to fail, aren't I? Let's just... Could I just... Let's just go and... Yeah. Yeah. Still not judging you. Right. I have a lot of trouble getting up this slope for some odd reason. I think it's just very slippy and steep. Okay. So. I'm going to feel pretty silly if we, uh... Oh. Night vision. Night vision. I tell you what, let, let, I just, if I'm going to take the night vision potion, I may as well, um, get the longevity out of it as well. Okay, that is a little better, isn't it? Okay, that is a long way down. Stay away from the edge. Stay away from Inigo. Okay, Inigo. What is... There's some sort of sphere. I really wish I could bring the explorers here. Okay. Okay, good news. I was right. Bad news... I'm not sure I'm happy that I was right. That was... slightly worrying. Okay, just, um, just, just, just in case. Right, um, I'm wondering whether you should stand over there and then, um, if something really bad happens, uh, I'm just going to come running at you. Yeah? That was my footsteps. Stay there. No, uh, stay. How can I help you, my friend? Stay there. Right Fair there. Enough. Right there. You want me to wait here? Yes. And if I come whizzing back at high speed. Sometimes I wish I was not so agreeable. Dude, do you want to go and put the stanza in? I'll stand here near the safe elevator out of here. 
You probably do, don't you? I'm wondering if I could actually tell you to do that. Um, all right. Get ready to pull that lever. Okay, it's fine. You can come. I say it's fine. Okay. I'm... Okay. I'm going to... See, now I'm wishing I hadn't told you to come, just in case. This, this might be the point where... Okay, no. Wraith God, right, right. This was, this was, um, um, oh, what was it? The tools of Kagranak, we've got all of the tools. Keening Wraith God Sunder. We've got all the tools of Kagranak, I don't, oh wait. Right, those were gauntlets. Wraith God. 10% resistance to all elements. You receive a 50% chance to reflect blows. 10% of armor. 50% disease. Okay. Oh, it's heavy armor. You may also wield Sunder because the hammer will kill you if you don't wear these. They do look nice, don't they? Okay, let's just, let's just get... Closer to the exit. Let's just get closer to the exit. I heard a very, very. How weird is that? Okay, this place is freaking me out. Let's try these uh, on upstairs. Yes. It's a little odd to have drips of water. In it go. Oh, you just jumped off. That's probably sensible. Let's, uh, let's just get in the tent and try these gauntlets on. Yes, the bodies I neatly stowed away earlier. Okay. Right. There you go. That was a, that was worth it. A little extra travelling, but we've got one of the tools of Kagranak. Okay, you stay out there if you want. Right, let's see how these... In a go. I... I think it's made my hand invisible. One of them. It's also changed the skin on one of my hands to... They definitely belong in a museum. Yes, definitely belong in a museum. I mean, it was heavy armor anyway, and, and they may look good when you're holding them, but when you put them on... Not so good. We can't take the carriage. There's no horse. There's no horse. How the... Out of curiosity... I mean, okay, so they, 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 they got a team of horses to bring all this stuff here and then sent the team of horses away. Away where? Is there a path that the horses could take because if so it would have been nice if they mentioned it okay what is that that does look like a nordic ruin right did we check over here I know we've been checking out a lot of Nordic ruins. I say checking out, going close to them and 
then going away. Still have hopes that I will find... The, uh, the coffer. Ognum's? Ognum's coffer, I think it was. Okay, you know what? Stay here. Okay. Don't take too long. Okay. Out of curiosity... Is that suspicious? Is that suspicious? I sort of look like a, a weird wraith, don't I? Okay, that's less suspicious and slightly more on the soggy side. Okay. I'm hearing a bear. War Chief Heavy Battle Crown. I don't know what that is. Okay, that's a troll. Just a troll's den. A wet troll. Um, actually, you know what? Oh, God. Hi! I'm um, uh, just gonna check around and see if there's anything, you know, that a troll would not need here. What have you got there? That's a very nice goat. Yes, it looks very yummy. I'm absolutely sure you'll have a great time eating it. It was a pleasure meeting you. Okay, there's nothing really interesting here. In a go, just, uh... I say that. What was that? War Chief Heavy Battle Crown. I, I don't think that's anything special, but... God, still raining, still raining. Right! I believe... I believe I failed to actually... Yeah. I believe, Inigo, that's it! We have no more reasons to come back here unless the boys discover something. In which case, yes! I promise we'll use the teleport to get back, okay? Are you happy? For now, let's get back to Rift and dry off and then, you know, plan what's next. We're supposed to be heading off to the college. She's definitely a lot more active. It, 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 it's, it's healthier, definitely. Yeah, we're supposed to be heading off towards the college, although I am thinking I would like to call in Windhelm. I've brought all of the cards with me. I want to see if we could trade some of the cards we've got and then create full packs of cards. Because there are spaces in the museum for packs of cards. Well, it's dark. If we weren't going to teleport there next time, what I might suggest is we actually just install a few more bloody torches along the way here. I have one completed job for the guild. May as well just report in on that, collect my earnings, and perhaps pick up another task. I do have some tasks in Windhelm, and I have a feeling we're going to arrive there sometime in the late afternoon, so we may spend the night there and get a few jobs done, as well as pick up those packs of cards. I am curious as to which cards I can and cannot swap and whether I will be able to make any um, complete sets. You know what? I'm getting a little blasé about walking in and out of this secret entrance to the Thieves' Guild, aren't I? I really should sort of come in here when I know nobody's looking. I mean... 
You would think people would notice the Thane of everywhere just wandering into the same damned tomb all the time. Still nothing. I mean, they are doing some work. I do come back here every now and again, and every now and again there's some signs that they've uh, been working hard, but most of this is me. I know that sounds a little self-aggrandizing, but it's actually true. I probably do about 25, 30 special jobs, maybe more, before they even add a few coins to the Guildmaster's tribute chest. I always have such mixed feelings when we arrive in Windhelm. I mean, on the one hand, it has some incredible architecture. It really is very impressive. But on the other hand, it's bloody freezing. But it's also picturesque here. It, it's, it's a nice looking area when the weather's not complete crap. And the city is beautiful. It's just filled with very annoying people. Some of whom are a little less annoying since I, um, you know, had a little conversation with their subconscious. There are unfortunately some who are immune to my charms on account of uh, apparently never ever wanting to sleep. Right. I'm going to check with the cards guy. I cannot remember his name. And then I'm going to uh, check which jobs we've got here because we're probably... My job? Well, I'm the watcher of the wheel, which is exactly what it sounds like. I watch the wheel. I do not like it here. Me neither. And I was about to say, I don't care. But now there's a little side of me wants to know what bloody wheel he's talking about. Oh, is it the, sh the fire. Is it Make the ship? Get the cold out. Wait, courier. Was it the ship wheel? Okay. Important deliveries to make. No time for chatting. That's nice. Excuse me. Solvar the Steady. Watching the wheel isn't as simple as you might think. Have to inspect all the way around the ice. Make sure it's not melting. Are you talking about the wheel on the ship, or is the wheel some place? He's talking about the wheel on the ship, right? He's talking about being a helmsman. Wait. When Ulfric was killed, justice was done. No. That might sound harsh, but it's how I feel. That's fine. Right. Vericio the Collector. I would like to trade some cards. What car cards do you have for I sale? Have a few choice cards available. That is nice. Price. I have a long list of things I need. Right, right. You've got arms. I. Ooh! You've got the queen. I need the queen. I actually need the queen. You've got the ten of demons. I don't need the ten of demons. And you've got mystics. Queen. I've already got the queen. All right, what can you trade me for? Yeah, I'm not completely sure I know how this works. Let's say I'm going to trade from the deck of arms. All right, and what card would you like to trade away? Okay, well, I've, I've got... Um, I've got ten of three, for example. Two, six, three, four, five, seven... Well, that's an interesting order. I've got a lot of threes. I believe I've got ten of them, actually. So, if I were to trade a three... Okay, then. What card would you like for it? Um, one... Oh! Can I get one from the deck of arms? I mean... Fair enough. Here you are. Nice trading with you. Oh! So, I... Right! I trade... One from the arms and get one for another deck. That's how I do it. Ah, so what I need to do, for example, I need the king of arms. I've got a spare king of 
Spiders. I've got two kings of spiders. Okay, I'd like to trade a card. Great. I'll give you a matching card from a different deck. What deck are you trading from? Um, let's go with let's go with spiders. Excellent. And what card would you like to trade away? I want to trade the king. Very good. And in return, I would like to take the arms. This will give me the king of arms. Yeah. Fair enough. Here you are. Nice trading with you. Okay, excellent. Right, and so now I should have enough cards to make deck of arms. Right, oh, and if I carry it, it gives me a bonus to one-handed and two-handed and archery skills while in my... Oh, is this one of those things where it might actually be worthwhile to, to make more than one pack just to have it in my inventory? Oh, that could take some time. Okay, well, well, that is interesting. Excellent. So I've now got less arms. All right, let's see what else I can make. I should now have enough cards to make a pack of the spiders. There you go. 15% chance of paralyzing and poisoning your foe when struck with a melee weapon. Uh, don't really need that, but sounds kind of nice. I also should be able to make the shadows pack. Nice. 10 bonus to sneak, lockpick, and pickpocking. Pickpocking? Pickpocketing skill whilst in your inventory. Nice. Then Mystics. Excellent. And Fortune, I think, is the last. Oh, no, no, no. I can also make Draconians. No, I can't. Oh, right. So I'm missing the seven in Fortune. Am I just? I could have sworn I had that. Do I have a spare seven? Does any... Oh, no, actually... I don't have... Oh, I could move one from Travelers, because I'm not going to be able to make the Travelers pack. I'm not going to be able to make the Travelers pack, so... Great. I'll give you a matching card from a different deck. Travelers. All right. And what card would you... Seven. Oh, wonderful. Fortune. And what would you take for that? I believe. Looks good to me. Unless I got that go. wrong. Right, then. Nice trading. Column. What was... Someone was about to say something. Fortune! There we go! Provides a chance of regaining health when you fall below 10% of your total health. Buy and sell prices are also 10% better. See, these have all got really nice bonuses. They've got really oh. nice bonuses, which is unfortunate because there's a place in the museum for them as well. Let's have a look which ones I now have. I have the Deck of Arms, Deck of Fortune, Mystic Shadows, and Spiders. Ooh, we are definitely going to be returning here to do some Good more evening. business once I get cards. The cards we need to look out for, it's less about the um, suit and more the number. Things we need a lot of are kings, queens, and maybe aces. I think everything else we can probably... F basically, we've got loads of them. I mean, like, I've got ten of something in nines, so... That's what I need to look for. Oh my god, it's... Wow, it's actually... We've been in there for hours. Sorry about that. It's just... Honestly, that's slightly addictive. Card collecting. Who knew? Okay, getting close to understanding that spell. Also getting close to understanding how to cast water breathing, although that's less useful because I've got the potions. Is, is there a spider on the ceiling? Okay, doesn't matter. Um, I'm going to have a quick snack and then I'm going to head on out and... and sort out the jobs. What? What? What is it? What, what is it? Right. And... 
Pretty sure I've gone through the entire book collection here. I'm just here, really, for a certain item. Of course, the question is, where is said item? You know, this may be a hovel. Aha, hello. This may be a hovel. But it's a large hovel. I have noticed that several of the houses in Windhelm, including my own, are rather large. It's a shame they don't do anything better with the real estate, to be honest. I mean, they could clean up for a start. Okay. And that is the last job for tonight. You know, strangely enough, all the times I've sweet rolled Windhelm, I don't think I've ever checked out the docks. I'm not expecting them to have too many riches, but sometimes you do have warehouses. And sometimes warehouses can have interesting items shipped into them. Also, people who work in warehouses do like the occasional sweet roll. Okay. What have we got here? A warehouse. Okay, we can start in the warehouse. And, oh my god. Right. I can probably just walk around here as the Thane. However, I don't really wish to be seen as the Thane wandering around in this neighborhood, I guess. And I certainly don't want to be seen wandering around in this outfit. People would almost certainly get the wrong idea. Well, no, they'd, they'd get the right idea. They'd get the right idea. Battle arm sword. It's got to be dark over here anyway, yeah. That's... Different. Okay. Was there anything else? I'd like to check the knapsack, but... I mean, I can always come back tomorrow as Leonard Thane of Winhelm and, um... Or is it Eastmarch? I should know the holds. But come back in an official capacity to, you know, inspect the premises for safety. Yes, definitely safety. I believe there is at least one other building. I could check the boats as well, I suppose. Sailors are going to like sweet rolls, aren't they? Out of curiosity, do any of these boats seem to have... No, the people are living on the boat. Looks very uncomfortable. And one guard there. A number of places to inspect here. Okay. Let's make sure that is refreshed. This lock looked more complicated, so let's um, go with that one first of all. A 
I don't hear anybody. I'm seeing lots of boxes. An empty chest. Books that I already possess. And a ledger. I don't want to steal the tankard. I want to check in the... I want to check in the... Oh, journal. Suvaris Atheron's journal. Private property of Suvaris Atheron. Please return to her in Windhelm if found. Journal for month of last seed, year 201 of the fourth era. First of last seed. Spoke with Master Torbjorn in the morning. Pleased with projects to increase competitiveness of shipping office. Spent afternoon overseeing offices and various paperworks. Moderate lunch and heavy dinner. Really? You're noting down your eating habits? Second of last seed. Punish one of the dock workers for laziness. Two days rations. Empty stomach means less good work for a few days, but he'll work hard from here on out. Moderate lunch and dinner. I'm detecting a bit of an obsession with food. Third of last seed. Correspondence with Uncle Mythorpa in Morrowind. Sadness continues to abound flowing west. Light lunch, no dinner. Fourth of last seed. Reports that our pirate friends are offering to let the company ships through in exchange for gold. We'll need to look into this. Heavy lunch and dinner, probably to make up for the previous day. Fifth of last seed, tried to get in to see Master Torbjorn about the potential issues, but he proved too busy tending to his wife and daughter in the morning. Did not wish to intrude. Skip lunch, waiting at the Shattershield house. Moderate dinner. Sixth of last seed, explained situation to Master Torbjorn as usual. Usual, he did not wish to know details, only how much money I needed to ensure smooth operations. I depart tomorrow for Dawnstar, hoping to catch the captain at Windpeak for his crew's regular festivities. Heavy lunch, skip dinner in favour of packing. Seventh of last seed. Beginning journey, planned to be back by the twelfth. Fifteenth of last seed. Returning safely, though not unscathed. Bandit attacks delayed the initial travel then stick salt plank proved to be more uncooperative than I had hoped chipped in some additional gold out of my own purse some cleverness in the books will see it repaid and the deal was done ate on the road light meals all round 16th of last seed hoping word gets back to Stig's betters of our new arrangements before more company ships can make it through found the Argonians had completely fouled up the operations in my absence. No surprise there. Need to see the old one's skooma supply. That should keep them motivated. Heavy lunch and dinner. That is an... E that is an extremely organised person. Shattershield. Was that the clan that's allied with the guild, or was that... No, that was Cruelty, wasn't it? Shattershield was... Okay, that was the family that basically, um, well, quite a few of them died. Strongbox Master. This is a very misty place. Very creepy. More ledgers. Don't have any jobs to forge numbers here. Steal from dresser. A dresser on its side. What sort of strange place is this? Okay. Okay. So...
Why is all the furniture? Is that a doorway? Are you trying to block a doorway? Why is all the furniture on the side? Why is there a cart in the middle? Seriously, what is... What is wrong with the furniture here? Okay, East End Bar Company. Hello? Hello? My name's Thane Leonard, and I would like to know what- I know this place looks horrible. Please, don't hold it against the company. I wasn't intending to hold it against the company. I was intending to hold it against you. What I is know this place looks going horrible. on? Please, don't hold it against the company. Why is it so run down and why is all the furniture pressed up against the walls? Sad, isn't it? We can't afford to keep the place running since these attacks started. Pirates, you see. Pirates? Raiding all along the coast, from Hammerfell to Vardenfell. Only the Shatter Shields appear safe. Who are the Shatter Shields? A very powerful family in Windhelm. They run a private shipping operation, and would love to have the docks to themselves. Wouldn't surprise me if they were in league with the pirates somehow. And do you have any proof of that? Not yet, no. But perhaps an intrepid person such as yourself could help with that? They have a dark elf who oversees their operations, Suverus Atherin. She's meticulous to a fault, and keeps a logbook with every transaction she makes. Oh. If it were to somehow end up in my hands, I wouldn't argue. Oh, yes, yeah, sure. I'll, I'll see what I can do. If you get me the logbook, I'll have proof of Shattershield's treachery. Okay, yeah, yeah. What else can you tell me about these pirates? They call themselves the Blood Hawkers. They've been around as long as I can remember, okay. but only recently focused on our ships. A dastardly group. But they're more than simple brigands. Shrewd, clever, not to be trifled with. I, um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, yeah, okay, uh, I will get right on that. And sort the bloody furniture out, man. I mean, just because you're not making that much money does not give you some sort of excuse for... I mean, why the hell is the furniture on its side? 